How's it going, YouTubers? Welcome back to the channel. Um, just finishing up a job here that's a little bit out of the ordinary. I ain't really got a whole lot to say about it. I just thought it was kind of unique and I wanted to let you guys see it. Uh, we're actually doing a theater, a uh, home theater in someone's house here. And they have requested that we put carpet on the walls. So, uh, started yesterday morning-ish and wrapping it up right now. Anyway, uh, we used a, let me look here. This is what we used to install. Oops, excuse me about that. We used this to put the carpet on the walls. It's a heavy duty clear wallpaper adhesive. It's a really thick pasty light glue. And the type of carpet that we put on there is a really, it's a really lightweight carpet. Um, I did go ahead and row cut all my seams. I attempted to uh, straight edge it just to see how it would do. And obviously whenever you cut across a row, you're left with that space in between, in between the fibers there, where you would it would look like there was gaps and stuff like that. So I did end up uh, row cutting all of my seams, and uh, the carpet on the walls is the first step of it. The other people did the hardwood here, but uh, you can see the actual seams actually look really good when you get, but this type it's like a car carpet i guess so it does look a little bit shade different in a couple areas some of most of them's fine you can definitely see that right there this side looks lighter than this side and uh over here is the exact same thing right good morning sean this piece over here actually looks lighter than this side over here those are the two that stood out the most however the seams are put together well uh they just uh look a little bit lighter than the others but you get that in this type of carpet it's almost like an indoor outdoor carpet this is a home theater center and they're making it look like a theater and stuff like that you see the platform platform and then down here is going to be carpet and carpet down in here so uh it's going to be let me back off and you can kind of see what's all going on here so this is it from the back of it there's going to be a huge projector screen and stuff up there so he wanted it as much like a theater as possible so he did carpet all the walls and uh done uh all the dark colors and everything like that to make it really let me get away from that window to make it really theaterish as much as possible just definitely different so like i said most of the seams turned out good there's a seam right there actually right to the side of this plug right there so carpet walls to help deaden sound exactly yeah it makes for great audio in stuff like this studios and theaters and stuff like that so that's exactly why he done that make really good audio sound uh anyway I don't have a whole lot to say. I just wanted to point this out because I thought this was kind of unique. You can see uh, this is from yesterday. Right here is the seam also. What did you use? What glue did you use? I'll point that out again. I used a heavy duty wallpaper adhesive right there. Uh, well, it's uh, the carpet. Is that what you're talking about or the glue? I'm not sure what you're talking about. Um, this is wallpaper adhesive, so I'm sure it's pretty much good for any kind of weather. So, uh, anyway, yeah, yeah, okay. Well, that's it right there. The, I'm sure the wallpaper glue is, this again is the type of carpet we put up there. It's a really lightweight carpet so that would, the glue would hold itself on the wall or the glue would hold the carpet on the wall. And uh, when's the home studio ready? Uh, Shouldn't be too long after I get back from Texas. All these walls, you can't hardly see them with the uh, windows over there. But every wall, but that wall back there, there you go, has got carpet on it. I don't have my gimbal hooked up right now. So I'm kind of a little shaky on the camera. Anyway, I took all of these little pieces like this. Instead of Dylan, this carpet came for foot and eight inches wide so instead of working from this corner and having all this empty and then just a little bit of nine inches of glue up here holding all that piece on i actually put a seam right there this piece above the door was one piece this strip is one piece 
this is one piece and then I started off with another full run that direction. So, and I've done the same thing here. There's a seam right there. This above the door is one piece and that coming down here, this side is one piece just to make all that a little easier. So anyway, just wanted to let you guys see that. I don't hardly don't do that every day. So I thought it was kind of unique and wanted to share it. Anyway, I'm off to do a glue down job now. So you guys have fun or thanks for tuning in. I appreciate it. Next week is the CFI meeting. Hope to see some of you guys there. Really excited about that. Y'all have a good day. Until next time, FBSB's out.